So we've got a new bench in here. We got this in the alley yesterday. It's pretty clean. We'll store all our tools inside there and our fish food for our new fish tank reservoir, which is temporary. We're going to uh, basically put this on rainwater that's been sitting, and then we will have taps coming out of it at the bottom. I have another tank I'm working on now. And then the two taps at the bottom will take out the waste of the fish and the crayfish, which will be in there, and then feed the plants over here so that we'll have it running through the fish and the crayfish before it gets to the garden. Now we have some sprouts already coming up here. Nothing coming up here. The corn's still germinating. We have tomato plant under here. And I'll show you this rack because last year I used a rack. And then when the cucumbers grew up, I put them through the rack and the cucumbers grew on the rack so that they are protected from bugs. So that's my uh, tip to most. And then I also did that with tomato plant so that tomatoes will sit on the rack and those will be gone by that time. Here's our blueberry plant. We're going to uh, transfer our seedlings into the ground where we have empty space. We have onions and stuff over there. We haven't had any real full day of sun yet so I haven't been able to see what the temperature will get up to. But right now we're at about 60 or so, 58 degrees inside and 45, 50 maybe outside. So there you go, the micro garden farm is coming along well and we also put the roof peaked in the center now so the rainwater will drip off the sides into the corners and I might actually be able to feed the pond by that but I also might use test uh, water from the uh, tap which will be diluted more than the rain if it is contaminated in the rain and we'll be able to do tests with the Geiger counter on all these plants versus the outdoor plants as well as spinach and uh, other things and limit the exposure and that is what we have set up so another week or two and we'll start doing readings and when we get our Geiger counters we're getting two of them so we will have a double check on all of the readings there you go small greenhouse garden in the city and tomatoes beans peas corn spinach, asparagus, raspberries, blueberries, cherry tomatoes, uh, carrots, and onions. So quite a bit of food hopefully. And we'll use this rack for germination and then we'll put it over the cucumbers as well as some of the tomatoes maybe and grow the cucumbers on the racks while the plant grows up through the rack. So there is my urban cyber garden for all you people to check out and hopefully you can do something better or do something just the same and have a good day